Hello everybody, and welcome back to this amazing baseball game that's coming up. And so, it, let's see who we're going to be playing. And so, it's going to be coming up in a f couple minutes, a couple seconds, sorry. So, the Sluggers, B. Ramirez, B. Higgins, D. Hughes, all that fun stuff. And now, J.D. Martinez being first, and pitching will be Tanner Houck. And J.D. Martinez will be playing this game. As Tanner Houck will pitch the first pitch, that'll be a perfect cutter. Yeah, Tanner Houck has a lot of potential, as that'll be hit to Devers, who will get the out. So, very silent at the field right now. And now we're going to put the sound effects out. Up. So the pitch from Tanner Houck. Be right in the middle for a cutter, a beautiful cutter, strike one. We go pitch, two strikes. And here we go, the pitch, a cutter. And we just struck him out with the cutter. Tanner Houck with his second, K, with his first K. And that'll be a strike. So the two batters, first one grounded out to Devers. And second one grounded out to, um, I mean, struck out. As that fastball will just tangle him up as the last pitch. Bam, foul ball. You guys, this is amazing right now. One and two, and that's going to be popped up high. Vasquez calling it. Hulk behind him. Vasquez will catch it, and that'll end the inning. We'll go to the bottom of the first with J.D. Martinez, Hernandez, and I think Devers. Up the bat, J.D. Martinez, his first at bat of the season. Low for ball one. It's going to be a great matchup. Um, pitch. And he swings too early at a 76 <coughs> mile per hour pitch. And J.D. Martinez will go all over it. That will bounce. <coughs> J.D. going one. Going around first, heading for second, and he will get a double. He will get a double. And up the bat now will be Kike Hernandez. Pitch, strike one. He'll swing too early. Pitch. Strike two. What a hit. J.D. Martinez will round. And they will put one on the board as Kike Hernandez. Kike Hernandez in quite of a big jam, but he will safely get back to second. As Jackie Bradley, sorry, not Davis, will come up to the plate and strike one. Strike two, um, and so Jackie Bradley's really been, got two homers as he's just struck out, but he had two homers and five RBIs. Up the bat, Devers, zero homers, one RBI, batting average at 444. Strike one. What a hit. Kike will run to third, and he will make it there safely. Guy on third, Bogart's up. Bogey will hit it. That'll go back. That'll get off the wall, and a run will score. Bogard's getting into second safely. And so now it's 2 nothing. No. Verdugo up to bat. Just a good lineup here for the Red Sox. A little pitch. So Verdugo's really been doing okay lately. He's been doing good, but as he pops out to Y Flores... And so we're going to the top of the second. Simpson, Flores, and Snyder. And so the first pitch will be in the middle. He should have smoked that. I, if I was him, I would smoke that. And what I think what the batter's thinking is smoke it opposite field. Have the shift on him. But he didn't swing at all. He struck out looking on a pitch that looks a little low. Flores, I, he's like, he's ready to... um. He's ready to hit the opposite field as the shift will be going left. Um, right, sorry. And so that'll be strike two. Hauk is doing amazing. Ball one, but Tanner Hauk is just doing incredible. And he just struck out the batter, so that'll be two outs. Snyder batting. Strike one. Tanner Hauk is doing amazing. And that'll be a hit right to Story. And this game will continue to be 0-0. Zero to zero. Trevor Story. That'll be outside. Ball one. 
story trying to make something. Strike one for Trevor's story. Strike two for Trevor's story. The graphics are a little weird. You just... Yeah. Pitch. Trevor's story hits it, but Flores will be there to get the out. To get Trevor's story out. And so we'll have one away. As Dalbeck will step up. And Dalbeck. Strike one for Dalbeck. Pitch. That'll be low. Ball one. I mean... I'd be afraid, to be honest, if I swing at that. And strike two. One, two count for Dalbeck. And Dalbeck will hit it. That will not bounce. Snyder will just be there to make the catch as they're two away. And up to bat now, Vasquez. Bono the second is batting average 429 with two RBI. He will hit it, and this will be a one, two, three inning. Top of the third now. Tanner Howe doing an amazing job as a pitcher. And so now the crowd is just, you know, chilling. The crowd is just chilling, you know, cheering, no noise. And so now here we go, the pitch. That'll be a little chopper to Bogart. It's easy to get him out. And so there will be one away. By the way, Howe only pitching 23 pitches. In three and and not then two point one innings, as the pitch strike one, and so now the pitch low, he will swing and miss strike two, and now here we go to this cutter and he will strike him out, yeah um that cutter of Hauk is just amazing, um that folk ball isn't that good, but it's cutter his cutter is amazing, Teddy. Yeah, I mean, we'll be. T I'll be talking next inning, but I he just struck out on a very inside pitch that could have even hit him. So guys, J D Martinez up to bat, and J D, look at that, he just got a single. Um, and so now this game right now, I mean, it is two nothing. Kike up to bat. Kike will hit it. Hey, guys, on first and second. Well, my own? Okay. So, first and second, Jackie Bradley up. And Jackie Bradley will swing and a miss. Strike one. He will watch a pitch that was inside. Pitch. Strike two. So, now one and two count. Two, two count on JBJ right now. What a hit, and Ramirez will go into a double play, but J.D. Martinez will go to third base as Rafael Devers steps up. Ball one, that was just a low folk ball. Um, and here we go, pitch. Devers swinging a miss. He's trying to swing hard. You can just see in that swing. And Devers will ground out. And so that's how the inning ends. Top of the fourth, it is two nothing Red Sox as Hauk is doing an amazing job of keeping them still. Um, that'll be a strike, one strike for Tanner Hauk, faking ball. And that'll be hit to Bogard, and he will get the out, one away. Up to bat now, B Higgins as that'll be hit foul. So one strike, go. How strike two with that cutter. He will strike him out with the cutter. <clears throat> that is just such a low cutter that he has. He loves striking batters out with that cutter. I mean, we've been nine minutes in the game. And it's already the top of the fourth inning. Two outs. One, one count. One and two count. And here we go. He doesn't use his... Um, cutter or franking ball, he uses his fastball to get him out. Up to bat, 5, 6, and 7 hitter. Bogard's up to bat. Really been struggling, not in real life, well maybe, but in this game he has, he's been a little struggle. And so now he'll get a double. That's that's good what he did. Verdugo, 0 for 1. As he will pick off the runner, he'll be safe. 0 for 1, Verdugo's batting average is 500, so... 
That's good that his batting average is 50% hit. Verdugo will hit it high to Flores. Bogart's trying to tag up. Will he be safe? He will make it. And so Bogart's made it to third up to bat now. Story. It's time for a story that we will hopefully be telling. Strike two. Come on, Story. Story will hit it to Flores and Bogart's coming in to score. And so now it is 3-0. Red Sox, and so now up to bat, Dalbeck, Bobby D. Ooh, that curves in, but it's high, so ball one. Bobby Dalbeck having some trouble lately. Ball two, he's having some trouble with um hitting the ball, but he just hit the ball with contact, so guy on first as we're 11 minutes in the game up the bat now Christian Vasquez another guy who's very struggled and Vasquez will hit it hard right to Flores and we'll come into the next inning top of the fifth we are I think halfway through the game that'll be a hit Vasquez coming in calling it and Vasquez will get an out one out Flores up to bat now <clears throat> One strike. Here we go. Strike two. And here we go. Next pitch. Strike three. And they will get him out on such a good cutter. Here we go. First pitch. Ball. Ooh, that almost that almost got him on the legs. And so now a cutter. Strike one. It's, it's a one and one count. Fifth inning. You wouldn't want anything better as he will swing at a high pitch. And so, that'll be a ground ball to Bogarts. He will throw it. Three outs, and we are going to the bottom of the fifth. So, this is the third time this game. And we start with the top of the lineup with J.D. J.D. Martinez will hit a single. And so, he's three for three this game. J.D. Martinez. Up the bat now is Kike. And Kike Hernandez will hit it. So J.D. Martinez is basically taking the spot of Jaron Duran today. Um, Jackie Bradley. Jaron Duran, um, not feeling so well. Um, so he will not be playing, I think, maybe, I think for five games. So, Kike running the third, he'll be safe. And so, and so, um, J.D. Martinez will score and Devers is up. Oof. Devers. We'll look at a ball. He's hoping for a hit today as he's 0 for 2. Kike trying to score. And he will score successfully on a Devers RBI. And so now Bogard's up to bat. Ball 1. And so Bogard's hoping for a third hit today. So strike 1. And Bogard's will get his third hit. And so this is being this is going good for Bogarts. And so now they will make a pitching change and Porter will pitch. Bogarts trying to steal. Will he be safe? He will be out on the attempt to steal as we go to the top of the sixth inning. Tanner Houck still pitching. Strike one at the top of the sixth inning. Here we go. That'll be hit to Devers and Devers will snag it. One away. For El Mendez. Strike one. Here we go. Pitch from Hauk. I mean, Hauk has been doing extremely good. Eight Ks. And that'll be hit to story. And that'll be two away in the sixth inning. Up to bat now. Be more. Strike one for um W more. Sorry. Why did I say be more? As that's hit to Devers. And there will be three outs. We will be going to the bottom of the sixth inning. And so leading off this inning is Verdugo. And now that'll be a hit from Verdugo. Um, we are really loving this game right now. And Verdugo just hits the ball. Up to bat now, Trevor Story. So after Trevor Story, as he gets a double, Verdugo going three. He is trying to go for home plate. He is running the bases. And Story trying for a triple. He will be out at third. Dalbeck up to bat. 
He's tried, like, he tried going to the plate and he's out. Dalbeck will hit it to D. Hughes. Nobody was expecting that. Dalbeck on base. And so Christian Vasquez up, trying to start something, as that'll be hit high as a foul ball in the stands. Whoa. That took, I think that took 10 seconds just for it to land. Vasquez on an 0 2 count. And they will strike Vasquez out as now he's 2 for 3. Top of the seventh, here we come as a double play. And there was a double play, and then struck Vasquez out. That'll be a hit. That'll get past Doy, and the no hitter is broken in the seventh inning. Kike Hernandez will throw it, and that'll be a successful double from B. Ramirez. The first hit ever in this game um, for today. Up to bat, B. Higgins. Strike two, folks. And a Frankie ball. Strike three, and Hauk will strike him out. Up to bat now, D. Hughes. Strike one. I mean, Hauk is still very dangerous. Right now, he has 61 pitches, 10 strikeouts so far in this game. And he hasn't even pitched seven full innings. So, he is he, he is very dangerous this game, surprisingly. As he strike two, this guy will pitch. That'll be a hit to Dalbeck. Three outs. We're going to the next inning. Bottom of the seventh. J.D. Martinez. Strike one for J.D. Martinez. I mean, he's been... He, in his first game of the season, been doing phenomenally well. And so, here we go, pitch. And J.D. Martinez will strike out. Up the bat now, Kike. Three for three. And he will be three for four as Hughes will catch his pop-up. And so now up to bat will be Jackie Bradley Jr., 1 for 3. And so his batting average went down a lot from when he entered this game. I think it was like 500 when he entered. Jackie Bradley Jr. will get a hit. And so he is 2 for 4 today. And up to bat now, Rafael Devers. And what a hit that is right to Higgins, right where he didn't want to. Three outs. Okay, let's talk about Rafael Devers very quickly. He hasn't been doing so good this game. I think he's 0 for 4. Um, I'm not really sure. But he isn't doing so good this game. Hauk is doing amazing this game. A lot of the batters are actually hitting. Um, ex Every player hit, I think, except for Vasquez. and um, Yeah, except for Vasquez, I think. I'm not sure, but as how pitches the next pitch, that'll be hit right to Dalbeck one away. Up to bat now, T. Snyder. He's the left fielder. He's 0 for 2. Only one person has gotten a hit off how, which is amazing and which is good that he's pitching good because we really needed him to pitch good today. So it's a 0-5. Pitch here. That'll be hit to Devers, and he will catch it three away. Two, two away, sorry. Um, He is still staying in the game, although it's showing that he has low stamina. He's still in the game trying to trying to pitch it out. You know what I mean? Pitch it out for Hauk. And that'll be hit to Dalbeck. Three outs. Go to next inning. Bottom of the eighth. And so Bogards will lead it up. Three for three. And he will be... Oh, my goodness. An error. And Bogards will stay at first. And so he is the first player to be four for four. Verdugo up. And Verdugo will ground him out into a double play. So Verdugo kind of puts the sadness for Bogards hit. Trevor Story... Up to bat. We want a story from him. He will not. He will give us a single. 
Nobody's hit a home run yet. Up to bat now, Dalbeck. That'll be a strike. Ooh, and Dalbeck won't agree. Doesn't agree with that call. But that was called the ball, and it was almost at, almost at the exact same spot. That'll be hit. Foul ball just missed the line. Oof. And that'll be hit high. Trevor Story rounding second, and that'll be caught by Flores to end the inning. So they will bring Tanner Houck right here, trying to pitch the complete game. Strike one, swing and a miss. Tanner Houck really wants to finish this game off. Um, so that'll be a foul tip. So two strikes for Tanner Houck. And they will strike him out in the top of the ninth. One out. B. Moore up to bat. W. Moore up to bat. Sorry. Strike one. And here we go again with this cutter. That'll make him swing and a miss. And again. And that'll be a hit to Dalbeck. Two away. One more out. He needs one more out. He will face B. Ramirez, the first and only guy to hit off him in the whole game. I know that's amazing, right? That's just crazy that he did that. Bogarts to field it, and the Red Sox will grab victory 5 to nothing. So that's the victory song. We, um, we won our third game of the season, and so I am so glad that we won. And so, um, how just did amazing, he did amazingly well, and he deserved that victory, he deserved to pitch full, he was the MVP, he let only one hit get by him, so, he did amazing, um, as you can see, J.D. Martinez, three for four, Hernandez, three for four, Bradley, two for four, Devers, ooh, Devers and Vasquez were hitless. Bogarts, three for four. Well, f yeah, with an error, so technically four to four. Verdugo, one for four. Story, two for three. And Dalbeck, two for four. So, it's just amazing. And so, now we're going to look at the leaders very quickly. The leaders for the leaderboard. Right now, let's go. Right now, and so, stats. So, batting average, leading in batting average is Kike Hernandez, 643. Then Bradley, then Story, then like five guys leading in batting average in the whole entire league. Then Dalbeck, and then all this bad stuff here. And so, J.D. Martinez and Duran, the batting average. Um, Duran is pretty low. J.D. is was amazing today. Three for four. And so now... Who leads with the most hits? Kike with nine. Doubles. Her Kike Hernandez with four doubles. It's just amazing. And so triples. Um, not enough of the Red Sox. Griffin, though, got his first triple. Of, and that's the first triple, I think, ever in the whole season. So it's just amazing how that happened. And so home run. Jackie Bradley, home run leader, tied in first with Ed Thompson with two. RBI, Bradley with six. And so, pitcher, Sale, and Hauk with zero. Innings pitched, Hauk with the most. Appearances, two with Matt Barnes. Wins, one and oh with Chris Sale. Losses, um, we haven't had a single loss this season yet. Saves, bar nobody, Barnes, nobody on the team got a save yet. Hold, nobody on the team got a hold yet. 11 strikeouts from Hauk, that is just incredible from how great performance so now this is our team tied in first with the knights uh era one better than the knights better than anyone actually batting average better than anyone on base percentage better than everyone slugging better than anyone no ps everything is just good looking good for the red Sox. and so next game against the knights pavetta Actually, no. Pavetta will not be pitching. Rich Hill will be on the mound pitching against P. Garcia. So we're, ha we're ready for that matchup. And see you guys in the next video.